Welcome to South Florida Saltwater Fishing. I'm Heath and it's Tips and Tricks Thursday. Alright folks, in this Tips and Tricks episode, we're going to go over one of the most commonly asked questions about the Daiwa Tanacom 1000. And that is, how do I make my digital display stop reading in meters and read in feet? Before we get into this though, if you want to learn more about fishing, grow as an angler, or just see some great and exciting offshore fishing adventures, you can start by hitting the subscribe button. And don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss a thing. Alright folks, so to start out with, I have to tell you, when you purchase your Daiwa Tanacom 1000, you're going to open up your box and you're going to notice the absence of one thing. And that is an instruction manual. If you want the manual, you will have to download it online. Like I said, we're going over one of the most common questions for the Daiwa Tanacom 1000, which is how do I get my digital display to read in feet instead of meters? When you get your Tanacom from the factory, it comes and it reads in meters. Now, to change it is a very simple process, but it can be confusing if you read it online from a forum like The Whole Truth or something like that. So, on paper, the process is simple. It tells you you're going to press the mode button, which is this button right here. You're going to wait for two beeps, and then you will see a readout that says feet. And then you will press the power lever forward until the feet mode reads on. Then you will press mode again, and that's it. You're ready to go. The issue is, is pressing the mode button and waiting for two beeps is confusing when written down. You're not waiting for two simultaneous audible beeps. You're waiting for the second beep. It's not two beeps in a row. We're going to go over a hands-on demonstration of how to get your Tanacom 1000 reading in feet right now. All right, so here we are in front of the Tanacom 1000. What we're going to do is we're going to power it up. You're going to see that it initially will read in meters. This is the factory setting. So if I put it in free spool, and I pull out some line, it is reading in meters. We are at 1.4 meters right now. So we want to change this to feet. So we'll lock the reel up. We'll retrieve our line. All right, power the lever down. Now, to do this is simple. This is the mode button. We're gonna take the mode button, we're gonna press it in and wait for the second audible beep. There's the first. There's the second. Now, you see this reading right here. This says feet. Now, you move your power lever forward until it says on. You hit mode again, and now you are in feet mode. You turn the power lever down. Now you can put it in free spool, and you will see that you are pulling out feet now instead of meters. Lock it up, wind it back up, and you're good to go. It'll wind you back up to zero and stop. And that is how you change the Daiwa Tanacom 1000 display from meters to feet. All right, folks, and it is literally as easy as that to switch your digital display from meters to feet on the Daiwa Tanacom 1000. Now, there is one more thing I want to mention. You cannot do that switch over if you've already let out line. You will have to be at the zero point. Let's say you've let out 50 to 100 meters of line, and then you say, oh, I want it to read in, in feet, not meters. You're gonna have to wind it back up and get it to zero, and then you can convert it to feet. All right, folks, that about does it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed, hope you had fun, and I hope you learned about how to switch your digital display on your Daiwa Tanacom 1000 to read feet instead of meters. Till next time, South Florida Saltwater Fishing. Going wherever the cool wind takes us.